Welcome to Art Resin 101. To get started with Art Resin, first prep your workspace and your art piece. Gather all the tools you'll need, such as a few garbage bags, stands to prop up your piece, painter's tape, a level, a measuring cup, a mixing container, a mixing stick, a spreader, a disposable brush, a pair of disposable gloves, an artist torch, our resin, your artwork, of course, and a box big enough to cover it. Make sure that your artwork is completely dry before applying art resin. If your work is on a large canvas, you'll want to reinforce it at the back with some cardboard to prevent the resin from pooling in the center. If your artwork involves ink, paper, or anything that has the potential to bleed or become saturated under the wet resin, we recommend you pre-seal your piece. If you plan to resin the sides of your piece, tape the underside of your artwork to catch any drips. Lay out a garbage bag on a flat surface. Prop your piece up on stands and make sure it's level. To determine how much art resin you'll need, use our resin coverage calculator at artresin.com slash calculator. Some people like to warm the resin and hardener in a water bath before measuring it out to reduce bubbles. Just make sure not to get any water in the resin or hardener as it will turn the mixture cloudy. With gloves on, pour by volume precisely equal amounts of room temperature resin and hardener into a mixing container. Remember to replace the proper cap on each bottle once you're done pouring. Black for resin, white for hardener. Stir your resin and hardener mixture thoroughly for at least three full minutes. You'll want to scrape along the sides and bottom of the container as you stir to ensure the entire mixture will catalyze properly and therefore cure as expected. If you see bubbles forming during this step, don't worry, we'll take care of them. Once you've mixed both the resin and hardener together, you'll have about 45 minutes of working time to spread it before it starts to cure. If your mixture is warmer than room temperature, your working time and cure time will be decreased. Pour and spread the art resin as you see fit. If you intend to coat the entire piece, start by pouring in the center. Use a spreader to guide it exactly where you want it to go or you can use a disposable brush to embellish only certain areas of your piece. You can resin the sides with a disposable brush or your gloved hand, or just let it dome neatly on top. After spreading the art resin, air bubbles will begin to rise to the surface. We recommend using our artist torch to pop bubbles for a flawless finish. Just hold the torch a few inches away from the surface, moving it constantly like you would iron clothes. Pick out any hairs or dust particles with a toothpick, and then cover the piece with a box to protect it from dust and let it sit overnight. In about 24 hours, your piece will be hard to the touch. After 72 hours, it will be fully cured. And don't forget, Cure time will be decreased in a warmer room. To clean and reuse your mixing tools, wipe them down with a paper towel promptly after use. Spritz with rubbing or denatured alcohol and wipe down again for a final clean. If necessary, wash skin promptly with soap and water. If you've taped off the underside of your piece, remove tape carefully no later than 24 hours post-pour. And voila! Behold your wonderful creation!